two fire trucks today. Wonder what's up. Am I due? I'm due to pick up these Amazon packages, but not before I drop off my donations. What's that thing? Not even gonna try. Beautiful outside. A cool 70. And the Bluetooth is connected successfully. Bluetooth is connected successfully. Good to know. Good to know. Look at that side of this city, huh? Before it gets swallowed up by this building. It's getting eaten. Ah! This is easy, Rush hour callback. That's not rush hour. It's about lunchtime. Enough of this inside jibba jabba. Let's get outside and get going. First, I got myself a, a package, a little present. I was always wondering how to get a package on the road. I didn't know that there was a way to get a package on the road from Amazon, but there is. With their locker service, you can actually get stuff sent from Amazon to a locker all over the uh, the United States here. I'm not sure how it goes once you get outside the United States, but in the United States, there's a bunch of lockers. You just type in your location, your zip code, and it'll pop up a bunch of lockers. It works without Prime, but it does need to be shipped either from Amazon or fulfillment through Amazon. You can also do it with Walmart. I think Walmart has a, uh, a pickup feature. If you really want it super fast, Amazon, if you have Prime, will do next day or same day if you order in a certain amount of time. All right, the pickup spot's somewhere over here. I think it said it's in the 7-Eleven. So, I don't know how that's gonna work. Interesting enough. I'm really interested in how this is gonna work out. All right, there they are. Hello, my name is Devlin. Amazonlockers.com. Here's all the lockers. Different sizes, so you could actually get some pretty big packages in there. Amazon locker. And you just, I don't know if you can see that, it's pretty glared out. You just put your pickup code in there. Amazon will give you a pickup code. It'll look just like this. See if you can steal it before I get here. You could also have it scan your code. But I'm not gonna lie. Tick times, Patrick. Tick times on the pet venture. Sent to the Amazon locker. I think that's I think that's pretty cool. The Amazon. Hey, soon soon the drones are gonna be out, right? Soon those Amazon drones. I could probably get full car service. Hey, I'm in this Walmart parking lot over here. Could you have a drone fly it over? Drum roll. The nighttime performance on this GoPro 5 Black. It's basically like the reverse of a vampire. You know, vampires can only do nights. Well, this GoPro can only do days. It doesn't do very good in the nighttime. So, what I've got is a thing called the Loom Cube. It's basically like the world's smallest but most powerful flashlight. And it's really small. I'm not going to get into it now. I want to get into it later in a different episode where I could actually get hardcore into it. You can see how you could set it up with um, cameras and GoPros and drones, phones even. And it just gives you so much more light than you would have. Hashtag hype. But don't worry if you don't pick it up. Amazon gives you something like three days to pick it up, and if you don't pick it up, it goes back to Amazon. They'll give you a free, uh, a full refund for free. Got this thing sent to me in Philly, and I forgot to pick it up until I remembered when I was in Wilmington, 40 miles away, and I was like, <laughs> Look on the side of the road, there's a giant hand. I don't know why, but there's a giant hand. 
this is that uh, that stadium over here. One of the football people play over here. I'm really bad. Carolina Panthers. There we go. What up? I'm smart. Here's the panther himself. Right on the side of that fence. Ready to pounce on unsuspecting victims like Broncos and Steelers. Definitely not stealing from that panther. He'll rip your teeth out. Bank of America Stadium. Looks so good passing it, I wanted to give it another go. I'm parked in a possible tow zone, but it says on stadium event days. They're towing me, they're towing that guy too, so. These things are awfully close. I almost bumped into it. Can't be safe. What do you think they're making? Trying to not park two miles away today. Because yesterday I put quite a couple of miles on the old stompers. I think seven. Which is good. Good to get the exercise. Get the heart pumping. Blood flowing. 18,000 steps. Woo! Can you beat me? Come on, let's, let's see it. It's go time. Get out there. What up? These are the guys I came to see. <laughs> Terrifying. I thought I saw something. Absolutely beautiful out here. Even that sight, look at it. I just love skylines. Charlotte's does not disappoint. The flags in the background. I seen this when I was looking, when I was in that traffic line, and I was like, oh, oh, dude. I don't think I've seen anybody rollerblading in a long time. Since Venice Beach, in fact. It's a very uh, Venice Beach-esque activity. A little, little football field right here. On Freedom Drive. The faces of freedom. <laughs> Man, that's cool. Got an El Camino over here. I love to see El Caminos. Reminds me of my name is Earl. Oh, Caminos are so cool. Horrible on gas mileage. But cool nonetheless. Ah, that's nice. You comfortable, buddy? <laughs> Looks like you've been there for a while. Your chain's quite rusty. There's a beetle on the roof over here. And a Triceratops. Oh, yeah, I'm smart. I know dinosaur names. What up? Let that freedom flag fly. Well, there's another one. Maybe there was an audition. This guy didn't make it. Certainly got the good look going on. I love those neons. And that sunset in the background. Imagine sledding down this thing. Extra level of difficulty because you got the cars. Better make it snappy. Now they train here. Look at all that graffiti, I love it. I'm trying to work. A hell of a job though, don't you think? sound and they're playing it. I wonder where it's going. Think it's back going back to the USSR? Back 
to the U.S. Back to the U.S. U.S.S.R. Fridge delivery. Two fridges and a stove. Thank you guys for watching. Starbucks in the background as I finish this vlog. It closes at 10. But it's 10.30. Still gonna upload though. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you tomorrow.